Okay. My oh, geese. The hell out of my way. Boy! Alright, so. See you at the crossroads so you won't be lonely. See you at the crossroads so you won't be lonely. I'm gonna miss everybody. I'm gonna miss everybody. Yo. I'm gonna miss everybody. Sorry. I don't want to get content ID because I'm so awesomely good. Ah, uh, shit, wrong button. Uh, this one? There we go. Let's see. Meditation. Alright. Let's see what Master Mirror has to say. matters little who I am. Your escape, I made it possible. Previously, Yennefer, you found her thanks to me, so you feel you owe me. Memento you gave me. Pretty effective reminder. Mm. That is its purpose. Incidentally, I find it quite funny how even the most rotten scoundrels have this inner compunction to repay debts of... You call me a rotten scoundrel. Humans, elves, dwarves, all races... You really must explain that to me one day. As for the here and now, tell me, how'd you manage with your feelings? They kicked my ass, dude. <laughs> Thanks for your help, really. But you could have chosen more conventional means, given me the key to myself, for instance. Oh my, far too simple. I dislike simple solutions. Do you like them? Doubt we're here to talk about my preferences. Mm -hmm. True. I'd much rather tell you about an individual of interest to us both. Oh? It's about a man, worse than most. A vulgar, despicable man with a heart of stone. <laughs> Name drop. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, sorry. Debts. Really think this will interest me? Any reason why? He's wronged you as well. Oh. His name is Olgierd von Everick. <gasps> How do you know he wronged me? How do you know we'd met, and that I'm not exactly thrilled with him now? Please, Why am I, not so... I knew the Ophiri had captured you. Was I not to know how this had come to pass? Olgierd von Everick did willfully and maliciously conspire to cause you to kill a man who might have been cured. Had I not intervened, you would have lost your head for this. Do you know why he did it? Because he's a degenerate monster in human flesh who feeds on the pain and suffering of others. Well, you clearly don't like him. What did he do to you? He and I made a pact. A pact under which I called on my many talents and associates to give him what he desired. Hmm. And now the time's come to pay. Yet, he shirks his obligation. Need me to collect a debt? I'm not some hired muscle. Muscle is not what this requires. It needs a soul intelligent and clever. That's me! An individual me. who fears no dare. Someone like you. Pure flattery, that. Of <laughs> course it is. After all, I am a traveling merchant. But make no mistake. I have many interesting wares on offer. Wares like? Surfing. Abundance for the body and soul. You will lack neither food nor drink. As a witcher, you might desire weapons supreme. I but I got all those. You dreamt of. Your body, agile as never before. Your mind, faster than lightning. Romantic prowess to charm all womankind. Yeah, I'm, a, all, I'm a one woman kind guy, dude. Great, true adventure. An experience like no other. The fate of only the chosen few. Sure sounds generous. And all that for my help with one small matter. Won't want anything else from me? Just one. Honesty. Hmm. What have you done for all good? Break him out of a cell too? In some sense, yes. 
remember that day quite well. There was a light drizzle, yet the cold tore right through you. Olgi had appeared at the break of dawn, gaunt as a wren, his shirt mm. moth eaten. Seemed to have naught but the sword at his side. It quite pained me to look at him. He asked for help, and help I gave. Made him a rich man, successful, esteemed. He is who he is today, thanks only to me. Hmm. And yet afterwards, he turned his back, shunned me, sends me off when I dare ask for payment. Even sicked his hounds on me once. He's thus left me no option but to invoke the terms of our pact. And that is where you come in. All right. What would you have me do? You, call yourself a man of many talents. Can't you take care of this? <laughs> but therein lies the catch. The outfit's kind of growing on me, by the way. But before I can find my due, I must yet fulfill three wishes for Von Everick. But I cannot fulfill them myself directly, making use instead of a... Mm, how shall I put it? A proxy. Mm -hmm. So what you need's a sucker. What I need <laughs> is an ally. And something tells me I shall find none better than you. What do you expect me to do? Well, to start with, I am join amazing. Join me in paying Von Everick a visit. Then, well, then we shall improvise. I believe, however, that all will end well. And, once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. Right. Specifics now. Thought Olgier had three wishes, requests, whatever. Uh, he does. He may ask three things of us. Yet we won't know what they are until we see him. All right. So be it. I'll help. Fine. I'll go see Olgier with you, but no promises. That is all I ask. Now remove the damn mark. Naturally. Just as soon as you complete your task. Pay your server. You will not regret it. We shall meet there. I have a matter to attend to along the way. Another debt to collect? Perhaps. Hmm. Alright, time to go visit Ogierd. I'm a real wild one, wild As one. Down with all horses. Mm, well, that do me. Okay, yes, things look a little different. All stink after three days. <laughs> so, uh. Our Ottoman will lead and guide you. Never sure hmm. to fight beside you. So this is on fire. Hmm. Sup, dude? Well, look who's here. The Witcher with the fists of steel. What's new? Got a growth on your platter there. You catch some kind of a fiery fox? Could say so. Manners burning, you noticed? <laughs> that? All right. You know how it is. Feast drags home with plenty of dancing, merrymaking, rough play. <laughs> We got a bit carried away, truth be told. Plain to see. Where's all geared? Damned if I know. Must be somewhere hereabouts. No! Please! I beg you! Shut your trap! <laughs> Let me go! Leave me be! Shut it! <laughs> I ain't with you! Drank with you! Fought beside you! Did you kill me now? I'm one of you! You might have been, but not no more you ain't. What's he guilty of? What the fuck's it to you? Not your concern, mate. Calm down, let's talk. Whoa, nerves a little raw. Why? You dead! Get the fuck out of here, freak! All I want is to know what exactly is going on here. Well, you're not gonna know. Shut off! I'll leave as soon as you tell me. Aren't you a thorny prick up the arse? Ataman said to kill him. Got your answer. Happy? Now piss off. We've work to do. Need to be edgy. Let's just. Geared wants him dead. 
Still don't know why, though. Just what the fuck is it to you, anyhow? Nothing really. Just curious. Cocksucker violated our chivalric code. Just one penalty for that. Death. What is this row? Like a scarred up Are David Beckham he is. My ears with it from the screams. Well then. Ah, Geralt. As you've returned, might I assume you've cleared the sewers? Or have you not been? Ah, you killed my father! Well then. Not I. You lie, Horson! That man killed him. Alone. Unbeknownst to me. Out of fury. For your father refused us hospitality. For this willful violation of the chivalry code, he was summarily executed himself. Wow. Anything else I might do for you? Take her away. I'd be a good lad, get this out of me back now. Had a boy there. That whole show. Ah, show. Come now. A man must display some madness from time to time. Helps him feel alive. Does he now? Dare say you know what I mean. Judging by the mark on your face. So you're immortal. You're immortal? Depends on your understanding of the term. Indeed, I cannot be killed. But it's not at all what folk imagine. Not dying does not mean eternally living your life to the full. So it's a curse? A curse? No, wouldn't <laughs> call it that. I'll put it this way. You must be careful what you wish for, lest you wish be granted. But there are consequences. Not sure I follow. You know very little could hurt you. So you take wild risks. Chase extreme sensations. There comes a point you've done it all. It all seems boring and monotonous. The tricks to play. You play footy all the time. Mary Victoria from Freaks Spice Girls. Have a couple of kids. I'll give him my reward. Get the beast in the sewers. Congratulations are in order then. Your reward. You're also welcome to take what you wish from the manor house. If it was left uncharred, that is. Uh -huh. Was it a tough fight? Oh, I sliced its cut open and it turned into a man. You know that would happen? Of course he did. He'd never have dragged you into this elsewise. Gone to all dear. Come to cast aspersions? No. I've come to collect a debt. You know, you first must grant you three requests by proxy. I present to you my champion, <laughs> Geralt of Rivia. That's true, you knew the Toad was a prince. True? You know the Toad was a cursed prince? He didn't just know. He brought about the curse himself. Did he not mention that bit? Well then, allow me to tell it. Quite a gripping story. You are a oh, creepy, dear, creepy narrator. A beautiful maiden named Iris. Yet, her parents chose to offer her hand to the crown prince of Ophir. Olgir grew to hate the poor sot. At first, mm -hmm. he wished to kill him, then decided this would be too simple. So, instead, he condemned the prince to a base life and a toad's bloated corpus. Yet he grew bored of watching him suffer and decided to end it. By your hand. Remind me, oh dear. Who is to fulfill my last three requests? My assistant, Geralt. Then be gone. I don't wish to look at your face any longer than I must. He must have had lessons from the guy back at the castle. Come. Where to? The stables. My men are preparing to depart.
Turn the prince into a toad. What he said about the prince. <clears throat> True. You turn him into a toad. Perhaps. Or perhaps the Afiri Dofa is something that disagreed with him. You never know about their cuisine. Never heard of food that turns men into monsters. <laughs> then perhaps it was something he drank. Mm. Obviously, you never met, never <laughs> ate a golden corral. Anyway. Revenge for a deep disappointment. I was another man then. Let rage get the better of me and hollowed the words without ever thinking they could possibly come true. Huh. Knowingly put me in danger? Could have told me the truth about the toad. Having a bit of fun at my expense. I simply wanted the beast dead. I could not know you would respond to the notice. Pure coincidence. Yeah, I must admit, when you, a witcher, answered the call, I thought it right. It's what you lot are trained to do. Might have been able to lift the curse. Perhaps. Perhaps not. Then again, why bother? He was a human being. That bloody appearing much was no human. His kind does not deserve to live. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Guess I Let's get to these three requests before you dig a hole any deeper there, guy. Do for you? Hmm. Let me think. We're currently without a roof over our heads. Perhaps we should start with that. Bring me the house of Maximilian Bosoni. His house? So surprised. But why? I must live somewhere, mustn't I? What's the meaning of this? Second leave of your senses. You mean to mount a filthy horse? Out of my sight, wretch. Know what Vladimir would do to you if he saw. Aye. Vladimir. My brother. There were times he himself stank like foot wrappings three days old. Oh, but his mount always looked fit for a parade. Oh, none rivaled Vladimir at feasting, carousing. Sadly, he's been celebrating less of late. You must find him and show him the time of his life. My second request. Fine, okay. seems easy enough. And the third? Complete those two. Then we shall speak of the third. Where will I find you? Once I'm done with those two, where will I find you? I cannot know, as my band has planned some diversions. But let us say at the Alchemy Inn in Oxenfurt. Fine. See you there. Hmm. Something tells me that maybe, just maybe, these are not going to be the easiest that quests. Be too hard. But the house? How am I supposed to bring him a house? Actually, the opposite. I wouldn't worry about the house. The brother will be the tough bit. Oh? Where is he? Olgierd's brother. Why do you think he'll be tough? I'm afraid he's dead. Has been for years. That's yes, son never of a bitch. To necromancy. Necromancy is hardly your only option for reviving a soul. An old fashioned ritual, a blood summoning. That's what you need. That's like choosing between pestilence and the plague. Besides, I'd need the blood of the summoned. Blood. True. Of the summoned, not necessarily. Here. Where do you get this? Geralt. 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 <laughs> aren't you the curious one? Assume it to be von every blood and get on with it. Hmm. Where'll I find this Vladimir? Geralt, I cannot do everything for you. Use your head. The von Evericks are well known in these parts. You must have met someone who's heard of the family. The charming redhead, for instance. Tris? The medic. Oh, Shawnee. You don't know one. Am I supposed to bring him a friggin' house? house? No idea how I'm supposed to bring him that. Ooh, the only Bosodi I know of around here runs an auction house in Oxenford. Heard of it. My swords almost got auctioned off there once. Auction was held in Novigrad, though it was a while past. They must have relocated. You just might get an opportunity to ask them why. Fine, I'll go there. Then what? How should I know? Perhaps you'll get inspired once you're there. Oh, and take plenty of coins. I have a feeling it could come in handy. Let's do this. Uh, guess it's high time I got to work. A bit more enthusiasm, Witcher. 
You know, you just might enjoy yourself. Yay, can't wait. <laughs> Say I need help. Where'll I find you? I shall find you. <sighs> Good luck, Geralt. Thanks. Thanks, dude. Alright, folks. Thank you very much for watching. Remember, you can get a new video seven days a week at youtube.com slash teamdaba. And remember, if you swing by teamdaba.com, you can check out the pull list that comes out every Wednesday from Jake, where he tells you what comic books you should be reading for the week. And, of course, the monthly Loot Crate review from Jamie, along with so many different articles, essays, and reviews from our awesome staff over at Team Daba. So thank you very much, folks. We'll see you next time. And until then, please remember, don't be a hero. Good night.